do a clean 25. Clean 25. Time to hurricane because I don't have a fairy resist. I'm hitting my hurricanes. This is and confusing his guard. And, oh my god! <laughs> hey guys, it's Gator and we're back on showdown for some more showdown live action. Not much to do, right? I mean, just screw around. Mega Save Live being suspect tested. Who actually cares, by the way? I don't give a shit because I don't plan on playing 6th gen. But I guess you do have to balance this stuff out because the older gens do get revisited from time to time. So, whatever. Um, we're going to keep playing in the suspect test thingy majigger. We got it's Gator, not because of a rally. Get a plus one on the switch with that dragon. Next, like Salamis, you know, you don't stand a chance. I raise a little just like Lance on the team. Uh, we don't have a Salamence. And we don't have Outrage. We have a Garchomp and a Dragon Claw. I guess that's good enough. But we do have plus one on the switch with that Dragon Dance still. So at least we got that going for us. Uh, yeah, there's that. And then it's just like an offensive sort of team with Scum Wave and Tornadus as pivots. I was going to put Roost on Altaria originally. But Ferrothorn could be a problem for Feraligator without superpower. And I didn't really want to put Fire Blast on Garchomp. That's more common than Fire Blast on Altaria, I guess. So hopefully we can dent it with that. Or whatever. I mean, plus two Earthquake still does a shit ton anyway. And uh, yeah. Let's just play. How much to say? Of course, we got the background. I'm pretty sure I've used this before, but I just rewatched this anime a couple days ago. It's so good. It's so I love the story in this anime. It's, it's beautiful. It's actually beautiful. Uh, it's called Planetus. As you can probably tell by a picture, it's about space. But it's about a lot of other things as well. So definitely recommend it if you have not seen it. And let's just play with our dancers. We got two Dragon Dancers and two Swords Dancers. And then Volt Switch, U-Turn, Thunder Wave, crap. For the rest of them. That's pretty much it. Well, I gotta do this, man. Like, what happened to them being right here? Oh, I have a stream open. I, I, is that is there audio on that? I don't think so. I'm gonna turn my AC off too. <sighs> Unprofessionalism, you already know. I get butt freaking cold in here because I'm not wearing anything but my boxers. He has a Dougie. Dougie actually does nothing against my team. Uh, we can, I think we can just destroy his team. I don't think his team is bulky enough. We'll see. It, it could be, especially if it's static Zapdos. That could be super annoying. Uh, but we shall see. I'm not Life Orb Garchomp, which I think matters. I am going to calc that. Let me close this stream out. I want to calc that turn one, because I don't think Life Orb Earthquake kills Mega Gardevoir. But I still want to leave Garchomp because I have Lumberry. Is the thing. Mega Gardevoir. Uh, it, it can't kill at all. And I don't have a good fairy. I don't have a fairy resist. Shit. <laughs> well, shit. Um, I'm just going to leave Tornadoes. It seems to be the least useful. I wish I was Life Orb, dude. Damn it. I was going to put Life Orb and Fire Blast on it. And put Roost on the Altaria. Life Orb kills guaranteed. That's so stupid. Uh, I'm going to do no damage to this. But this is the least expendable one on my team, I think. So, I'll take it. Oh, he actually didn't. What is, I don't have a, fa a fairy resist. What was that? What do you think I was going to do? Why not? Hyper so, that was just a bad play. There's no way this is a good play. Hyper Voice is way better. Oh, he's some trash. I mean, it doesn't. If, as long as he has Hyper Voice on the set, it does not actually matter. I'll just let this thing die. Oh, he actually does. Whoa, what's this? Let's go on a chomp now. Um, what am I looking at? I don't know. Don't be telling me you're running like bulk on this shit. He's running bulk on it. That's good. That's nice. That's very nice. What the fuck is that? Why you bring bullshit into my game? <laughs> Whatever. He brings bullshit into my game, so be it. Um, I can just go into this. U-turn. I actually don't even know if U-turn's gonna kill. Um, and he can just willow us that. Just gonna U-turn should kill this. It's a. It's, I don't care if I'm burned and I have 106 attack. It's it's at eight percent. This no. This is pressure. Okay. Uh, I'd like to attempt to knock it off, but with Garchomp dead, how am I actually going to dent this thing? Especially that, that I don't have Will-O-Wisp. 
Altaria could dent this. Mm, we don't know if it has HP Ice or not. What type of status he's packing. Or if he even has Heat Wave. I'm going to go into Bisharp. Um, and I think I'm going to just go into Altaria to see. I don't know what he wants to do. Okay, he does have Heat Wave. Now, I think this means he probably doesn't have HP Ice and he's just like a defogging set. Uh, so I think he has Roost and Electric Attack. So I think I'm okay to Mega in front of this thing, even if he has a Skarm. Uh, and I actually think I can click Dragon Dance and be okay with it. I can also click Fire Blast right off the bat. You can try it one time. Uh, he stays in. I don't think he can do anything to me. Oh, and I burn him. Okay, he's just gonna bull switch out, but yeah. I burn him. It's Pokemon. You all like Pokemon. So he brings this thing in. I am weak to Hyper Voice. Now, my switching is Tornadus. I, I don't really have anything else. And it still takes half, so there's that. Yep. Just gonna U-turn out. I don't know what the fuck this is. Why is this a set? It just so happens I don't have a fairy resist. It just so happened that I didn't have one. Unlucky. But Zapdos is burned now thanks to Fire Blast being an amazing move. So now this Zapdos is a lot easier to deal with because it's burnt. I actually just go right back in Altaria. And I outsped him. I don't think there's a point in Dragon Dancing. I'm just going to fire off a return. Because if he goes into Moongus' Garmy, I get damage. If I Dragon Dance, that doesn't happen. Do 27, and I do have a burned assault vest torn, which is a pretty good pivot into an Amoongus. <laughs> oh, he makes the double in the Suicune. Will that matter? Is the question. Will that matter? I'm just gonna knock him off. Okay. Can you stop? So I don't want to lose this mod, so I'm actually gonna U turn. I don't want to lose Tornadus. If I knock off any skulls, I think I'd die. Potentially. Not sure. Probably not. But I'd be even lower. Where I can just leave. Because this is a pretty good check to Amoongus. And it's kind of my only switch into any hybrid voice. Oh, cool. So he went Zapdos anyway. Uh, so this is getting weaker and weaker. Rinse and repeat. Just going to return again. I know he's regenerated on this, but it's like, why not return? Um. Yeah, when I have the tornadoes just sitting there. So you might make that double in this weekend again, because it's pretty safe. Don't really care though, just because I have the tornadoes. So this one actually did more than I thought. Why did it do so much? That's not, that's not good. Oh, I really want a U-turn. Let's U-turn. See if we can do it. I mean, I'm in such a bad position. He should spore here. Uh, I don't know if he'd risk his move. We'll see. We'll see, like, both him staying in or switching to Zapdos, I can see both happening because Zapdos is so low. Um, he might just want to stay in. I'll just U-turn. Worst case scenario, something goes to sleep. It's just a question of what. I think Bisharp is okay. If I had to pick something. I guess he's Sludge Bomb. Why? If you're going to predict, then predict. I, I don't get it. Uh, I think I'm good to click knockoff here. Yeah, I think we're good to click the good old knock. I guess he can go Dougie. Dougie looks to be his rocks. Yeah, so I'm just going to knock off again because I'm pretty sure he's going to go for Stealth Rock. Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't have Hazard Removal. Um, yeah, I don't have that. <laughs> Which could be very annoying because I actually don't have a lot of... I actually have no... Rec it's, it's a hyper offensive team and he has like a super defensive team. Which is bad. Because I wasn't expecting to run into any of these, especially with Sableye gone. But that's what he has. Now, I do have some wall breakers. This is pretty much a wall breaker. It is adamant as well. It's not going to outspeed this, I think, because it's adamant. Unfortunately. Hmm. I feel like he still has a roost. I don't think he's in a position to heat wave. I'm going to go for Nog off. Yeah. Didn't think he was in a position to heat wave at all. Because uh, if I went in Altaria, he's just like screwed. So he'll probably roost again. The best I could do is SD. He would be at what, 80, 70 something? We can calc that. 
Uh, I have. I don't have enough. Do I want to play? I don't want to play those games with him. How am I winning? I need rocks. I, I don't get rocks. That's. I don't. I don't get rocks. Let's play these games with him. Let's just play some games. Let's play some fucking games, dude. I, I was gonna cow plus do sucker punch. I don't care. Let's just play some games. Let's play. <sighs> okay, it died. Didn't need calculate. It just died. Yeah, we played some games. He could have roosted again. Could have done a whole bunch of stuff. Could have switched around. Uh, but nope. Just death. Pretty good. That was a close one. I think he loses. Uh. No, he might. He can go into Gardevoir and play more games with me. Yeah. Hmm. I think that's the only thing he can do is go Gardevoir unless Garvey has counter. He did go into Skarm. Do I just knock? I just knock off anyway, I think. Even if it has counter. That's just a bunch of damage. Tell for Alligator. It does have counter. Uh, I think Rotom is fine here to Volt Switch. I don't think I want to go into for Alligator. If I do, what am I doing? Ice Punching? It's like... There's not. I guess I could crunch. But Rotom's just good. Cause I get the Volt Switch, which is the important part. I mean, you can save this if he wants. I don't see a point, but Volt Switch is good here. Should I have Iron Headed if I was expecting counter? Try and get a flinch. Maybe I should have Iron Headed. But what if he? It was, it was just he could have Whirlwinded, which is like the more common move. Okay, so if I hit Hurricane, I should be able to do a lot. If I hit. Or I guess you turn out like a bitch. Um, I actually don't know if I can Hurricane. I might not be able to. I think I have to. I have to risk it. 70%. I've hacked him so much. If I miss, I lose. Pretty sure if I miss, the game's just over here. We do hit. And we crit. Uh, pretty sure that mattered. <laughs> we, we just hacked him to death. You know, just hacked him to death. No, no problem. No problems. I guess you turn. Uh, into what? Should I just knock this off? And get it over with? I think so. I can just knock him off. Just get rid of these leftovers. He's gonna start setting up in my face. Yeah. I guess you turn into. Um, one of the dragon dancers and start setting up. Probably Altaria first. Oh yeah, I forgot you guys protect. Oh shit. Okay, well. Whatever. Start dragon dancing. What? His only attack is Scald? Oh, he's just gonna try and... Oh, why'd he do that? What if I dragon dance again? He's gonna try and pee-pee stall my returns? Oh, he just went for the burn. And he didn't get it. And we just kill him. Is this, this... Didn't Chimpak use a set like that? Is that Chimpak's team? Hey, it's time to do some... Time to, let me see something real quick. We can get another one. Let's go, let's go to Chimpak. Let's hit up Chimpak's channel real quick. Can you use, where is it? Let me turn my. We got Pokemon strategy decks, number one, Suicune. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Did he use this on a team? Uh, okay, I see a Suicune. I don't see it on that team or that. Uh, I, don't, I don't see shit. Okay, so that was not a Chimpak team. But that was a Chimpak set. That was definitely a Chimpak set, so. Because I see it right there. It has Combine, Scald, Sub, and Protect. It has a bunch of speed. That's why I just fell over to that return. <laughs> oh, he has a Ferrothorn. So this is why we have the Heat Wave on here and the Fire Blast. He also has a Gardevoir. Ah, mmm. Yeah, I've had it. I've seen enough of that shit. It's so annoying. Garchomp would be a good lead if it killed Gardevoir here. But it doesn't kill it. So if he leaves Gardevoir, I just lose him on again. So. 
God, that's so stupid. That's actually super frustrating. I don't have a good lead against Gardevoir then, at all. I just don't. But like, why am I facing two Gardevoirs in a row, you know? I could lead Chomp anyway. I don't have a good lead. I just, I don't have one. I don't, I don't have a good one here. It's just like Tornadus again, and Tornadus is kind of useful. Oh, he actually didn't lead Gardevoir. I guess that's good for me then. So I can just click knock off turn one. This looks to be his rocker though. Could U-turn. Actually, I yeah, U-turn more. Because I can go into Chomp immediately. And at least exchange rocks. Oh, okay. Are you serious, bro? Are you serious? I just realized he has no ground resist. Maybe I don't even want to get rocks. I just want to clear Earthquake because it kills everything on his team. Or maybe I just click SD. Do I just win? His, he has to have, like, Scarf Kiram. Oh, oh, shit, shit, man, I'm, should I just stay in? Why do you do that? Why do you hard in the Kiram? These boys are insane. He, he might be Scarf, bro. He might be Scarf Kiram on the He ain't got nothing. For, like, he just gets 6-0 by, like, Landorus and shit. Like, mo the most common Pokemon. He just gets 6-0'd. Oh, I, I should switch, but, like, it, <sighs> Okay, what is what happens if he ice beams here? I lose my. Ro I should switch. I should I should switch into like Bisharp or something. I should. I'm going. I'm going in. I'm scared. I'm scared, Mama. I'm scared, Mama. I'm scared. Oh, that did so much. It was life orb. I'm a bitch. I'm a fucking bitch, bro. Holy shit! What a bitch play. Man, fuck this. I don't need this damn Pokemon anyway. Just kill me. Oh, he switch. Hey, thank you. Why you switch? You don't have a move to kill me with? You definitely had a move to kill me with. What was that? Why you switch? Go ahead and iron head this man. You got your one layer of spikes up. Why did he switch? Well, I guess you can ask why did I switch as well. Why did he hard switch into Kiram on Garchomp? What was that? I guess he thought it was defense. Oh, he's going to let me get damaged. This. this is beautiful. What? Hold on, hold on. Is this his rock user? I just realized like he had spikes on the Klefki. This might be his Roxy. Oh no! It's why does he have Ferrothorn and Klefki on the same team? You have Protect on this. You have to have some move on it. Okay. He does have the Protecto. I already revealed. Oh, I already revealed SD, so he's not gonna be scared of Fire Blast. Um, Tornado seems to be a good option here. Just Heat Waving seems to be fine. Yeah, Heat Wave seems to be okay. All right. Well, this is this is his biggest threat. Do a clean twenty-five. Clean twenty-five. Time to hurricane because I don't have a fairy resist. I'm hitting my hurricanes. This is and confusing his guard. And, oh my god! <laughs> what? <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Tornadus. Uh, does you turn kill? Does you turn? How much? I'm timid, so I have two twelve. Ornatus. Tim timid. Timid. Mega Gardevoir U turn does a min of 22. Is that right? We U turn out here? We can U turn up out of there after hacking him. Nice Pokemon. That was very skilled. I'm a very skilled player. No fairies is no problem. Uh, so I think back in the Chomp is fine. We know his thing is Life Orb. It probably eats a Dragon Claw though because I'm not Life Orb, but I'm definitely Life Orb now. Oh, he actually went back into this. Um, so I think getting up my Stealth Rock is what I'm going to choose to do. Yep, he's just going to Elite Seed or something. Yeah. And at this point, I should be able to go back into, into Tornadus, even if he double seeds. It's not that big of a deal. Matter of fact, I could just throw in Rotom, just because it doesn't do anything. I'll just go Tornadus. It's fine. Okay, so he just has spikes on two Pokemon. So he's just an insane human being. Like, well, why do you have that? Um... So I just heat wave, like even with the oh, it lived. How? What the hell? Um, I could go into Garchomp. I get. There's no point. I don't care if he protects. There's no point. I just spam heat wave. Spam it. Uh, as Karam gets a little bit of recovery here, not a problem. Oh, just try to double protect anyway. Here comes Big Black. Uh, we just U-turn into some sack. What are we sacking? Altaria? 
because it doesn't do anything. So why not? Just sack Altaria. Went for a Dragon Claw. This man's all about his power. Because uh, I'll go on the Chomp. I don't think uh, Earthquake actually kills this. He's not going to switch anyway. Why would he switch? He's going to Dragon Claw, so yeah. And if his drill is scarfed, that's fine, I think. He just goes into Jirachi anyway. Uh, I don't know what he actually has on this Pokemon to hit me with. You see how weak regular... Okay, Serene Grace. No Serene Grace. Oh, never, never mind. Never fucking... Mi oh, wait, I had Longberry. <laughs> Objection! So I guess the item did matter a tiny bit. Oh yeah, I forgot we had no points because I don't play suspect. Or the suspect just came out or whatever. Um, it is life orb now, right? Yeah, that's what it should be. And we're going to run into a Gardevoir again. He's going to lead off with it. I'm going to kill it with an Earthquake. He's going to kill it. My life orb Earthquake from Garchomp is so strong. It just one shots like common mega lead Pokemon. Like Metacham dies. Just falls over. Gardevoir falls over. Oh, well he doesn't have that. He just has a, a Zard that does not fall over. But I think, well, I mean, is it Y? Yeah, it should be Y, I think, because he has a spin here. Possible pursuit here. Pretty sure it could be an X as well. It, it's a little, I'm pretty sure it's Y though. He has hard wall, like his Tangro destroys my team. <sighs> nice Tangro, dude, nice Tangro. Don't have Lumberry, so I can't set up on road. Now this is a game where Lumberry would have been pretty nice, actually. Really nice. I just don't have it. That's bad. I think I'm gonna leave. Ro I don't even have Will-O-Wisp. And he has Spin. This, this is shit. Where's my Lumberry? This is actually really fucking shit. All of a sudden. I'm gonna leave off Altaria. It threatens Rotom and Garchomp, and it's the only one that does both. I guess it actually also destroys Charizard now that I think about it. There's no way Charizard beats me. So I think I can just Dragon Dance in regular. Only reason being, if he goes Tangrowth, I don't want to be mega nor switch against the Tangrowth. He can just Dragon Dance here. The only, the only way this is bad is if he stays in and is X and goes for a Dragon Claw for some stupid reason. He goes Rotom. Um, so he's definitely going to try and Will-O-Wisp me, and I don't, <laughs> I don't have a Lumberry on my Garchomp. Hmm. This, this, this is a crazy calc here, like this, this is the first time you'll ever see this being calc. I'm going to calc a plus one regular form Altaria's return to a defensive Rotom. That is what we're calcing now. Let's see this amazing damage. Non-stab, nothing. Plus one. Does about 30%. Now, how much does it do to Mega? How much does Mega Altaria do to it? A plus one. That does about 80. So we can do 30. We can do 30, right? We can do 30 and then take the Willis. We can do 80 right now. I actually think 30 might actually be better. I'm going to go for return in regular form and just do 30 and just do 30. I'm going to take my 30. I'm actually going to sit here. I'm just going to sit here until my Altaria dies. That's actually what I'm going to do. I'm just going to fucking sit here because I don't, I don't like anything else on my team getting burned as he crits me with Volt Switch, whatever, whatever. I just don't want anything else on my team getting burned. It's just too, it's too risky. It's way too risky. Uh, Tornadus is pretty important. Sem it's, it's semi important. And I have for Alligator, which is, I think, my main win con. And the only reason I need Altaria is to potentially Fire Blast the Tangrowth. And it doesn't need to be, you know, healthy for that. It just comes in and Fire Blast them. Let's start the timer. Oh, I could have done 80. Damn. But then he would have just Pain Splitted it all off, potentially, anyway. So, I guess he couldn't. I would have killed it afterwards. Should I have taken my 80? 
Maybe I should have taken my 80. No, the idea... Well, I don't... It doesn't matter if I'm burned or not to Fire Blast Tangro. I think I should have taken my 80. How much does a burned return do? Okay, I should have... I should have definitely returned this. I should have Mega Evolved. Okay, yeah, I should have Mega Evolved. I didn't... Okay, yeah, that was just bad. I wasn't thinking. I was not thinking completely. I was half-assed thinking, and then I just did Oh, he's not even here. What the fuck, dude? He probably just... He's... Okay, no, I was definitely thinking. This boy's in a state of shock. I went for return in, in regular Altaria form. Complete disrespect. Now he thinks he got Mega Garchomp and regular Altaria against him. That's probably what he's thinking right now. Okay, so what I should have done is Mega Evolved in return because the, the Burned return would have killed him. And the Burned return probably means he goes into Tangrowth. And at that point, I can Fire Blast the Tangrowth because it doesn't matter if I'm Burned. So, the, me Mega Evolving was a good way to bait in the Tangrowth and Fire Blast it. So that was just bad. I shouldn't have stayed in regular. I should have Mega Evolved. I take, so I, I, that was bad. That was just misplay. Complete, just shit play. Terrible play. Yeah, the Scizor. I get six old buses or pretty much. Don't have Willowis on this that Thunder Wave. Well, he also has a Seismitoad. Like, what is that? What the hell is a Seismitoad? I think I still leave with Garchomp. Uh, what, what do I do if he leaves Weavile? Just lose a Pokemon? Yeah. Lose a Pokemon if he leaves Weavile. Oh well. Well, I guess I lose a Pokemon. That's unfortunate. I mean, I'll go in a Rotom and just hope. A man, a man can pray, right? A man can pray that he does not go for knockoff. I can, I can just pray. Cause it's the only thing I can do. Literally, the only thing I can do right here is hope he does not go for knockoff. Ah. <sighs> um. GG. I don't. It's GG, pretty much. Um. Should I go in the Bisharp here? I'm like I'm liking Bisharp here. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna go Garchomp, I was really like, eh, that's not good. So he does have the Scizor, but it's not mega yet. So I think knockoff is actually Iron Head might be okay. I don't know if he's gonna go Tarak or he's gonna go Scizor. Or if he just has like some move to kill me, but I doubt it. Knockoff seems so obvious. Uh, but I mean his scissor is there and it's not it can still switch into not mega knockoff, is what I'm worried about. If I knock off his Terrakion, I think I lose a Pokemon. Eh, fuck it. He's not going into it. Yeah. That boy's staying right there. You stay there and just die. I miss your Drago too. Yeah. Yeah, what up? He's not going to pursue him. I don't know why though. I don't think I'd use Pursuit on a team like this. What, what do I need to trap Lotties for? I guess I have Bisharp as my only Steel type. So maybe I do have to trap Lottie. Okay. Good. Good play. He made, a, he made a good play going for Draco. <laughs> well, the threat is in. I think I sack Rotom. He's just going to CC. I don't see why he would edge. I do have Tornadoes, but I still don't see why he would edge. Mm. Tornadoes is too useful. Rotom is dirt, dirt useless. So, just going to sack that. I can also see if he's Life Orb. So we don't know what he is. He could be sashed. It'd be super annoying. Um, I think Altaria is still the play. I just DD. Yeah. I need to see if Fire Blast one shots the dude. The dude. The Mega Sizz. Mega Scizor. Fire. This is adamant. It's not. This is not what this kills. I don't know, it's high base. No, it kills regular scissor though. So what I might be able to do is Altaria and just fire blast immediately. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I'm just gonna fire blast immediately and hope. I don't know if he's gonna stay in or not. But if he stays in, he's a genius. This boy's a genius if he stay right there. Cause I'm making the play. Now we just gotta connect. We just gotta connect. If I miss, I'm leaving. It should die, it should die. He's getting read like a book. This boy getting read like a goddamn book. Okay, well he brought this back in. The only reason he brings this back in, I guess you can Stone Edge. But I like he brought this back in. I'm thinking he's gonna Iron Head. I can use Chomp as a 
pivot here. He's not gonna close. Like oh, he fucking close combated. I live though. What the hell? How did I live that? I'm offensive. He's not, that's banded damage too. I think I got my rocks up here. Yeah. Pretty sure that is banded. I don't know. If, I don't know. I actually don't know. Also, don't know if default works if I die. <laughs> uh, I I don't know that. I think I. I don't know. I'm gonna look stupid if it if I Dragon Claw and he gets to just defog. I'm gonna look stupid. Uh, let's let's test. Let's see what happens. Okay, well that shit don't matter. Oh wait, he's static. Okay. Well, he's static, so never mind. So here comes a problem. He has Toxic. He just showed Toxic, and I don't have a means of killing this from this range. I think Heat Wave one shots my my Bisharp as well. So maybe I have to go into Bisharp and just click Sucker Punch. And then go Altaria after. Like it's, there's no good option here. Yeah, there's really not. Um, I think Banded Terrakion is just going to beat me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I could attempt to Dragon Dance here. If he hits the Toxic... Um, no, I think that's what I have to do. I think I just have to... Unless plus zero return kills this. Oh, what the f... That's not... Oh, I'm burned. That's burned. Oh shit. Jesus, that scared me. Healthy. Plus zero return. Okay, it does not kill. I need plus one. I actually have to get plus one here. Unfortunately. Yeah. But I, I, he loses mons. Like, he can... he. This is dead. This should die. If it's physically defensive, it should still kill. It's just that... If he keeps Terrakion alive as the last, I'm in a bad situation. Um, Ice Shard does not kill me. Actually, I don't think it does, like, any damage. Okay, that does way more than... It does... Okay, it does, like, 60. Um, and if he has Quick Attack on Tarak, it's gonna finish me off. I guess if he Quick Attacks, that's fine. So he should charge here. Yeah, it does 60. So if he doesn't have Quick Attack, he loses the Zapdos. And last Mon Tarak... Okay, they can't win. Yeah, so going in Altaria first was correct. Um, unless he has Quick Attack, then it's... No, because if he has Quick Attack, I just DD up with... It's Gator, not because for Alligator, which has done nothing the whole live, by the way. It doesn't abs... Okay, so he brings it in. I guess he can Static my for out. That's fine. Yeah, I, I actually clicked Dragon Dance because I thought... I just knew, holy shit, I like did that instinctively for some, I was like, oh, he obviously has quick attack, I just click whatever the fuck I want to on the damn Altari. What if he didn't have quick attack? So, if he statics this, he goes in the gator, I mean, he goes in the track, he clicks CC. I have to hit a hurricane, basically. Is there any way to get me out of that situation? Like, going to Bisharp, he could stay in and quick attack, and I'd knock off his ban, which would be terrible. Oh, I think I just gotta risk the static. I think I just gotta risk it. Oh yeah, we're just gonna DD up. Just gonna DD up and hope. Oh, he actually stayed in. I mean, he's gonna go to zap those here anyway. You just gotta hope. That's all we can do. Uh, plus one waterfall should kill. Oh, he just says no. I don't want to win. Okay. I mean, you showed static, right? I don't. I don't know what that was. He should have. Should have definitely went into zap those. Oh, what time are we at? We are at 30 something minutes. Uh, did we get four battles? I think we did get four battles too. Or four or five. I don't remember. So we'll wrap it up with that. Um, yeah. Not really much to say before Sun and Moon comes out. Then we can try all the new fancy stuff. But we can still use for alligator every once in a while because it's getting knocked for alligator. You know how it is. But uh, yep. Leave a like or comment video. As always, greatly appreciated. And it's getting out. See you guys next time.